guys, what is up? Hall Derka here, and today I'll be playing Animal Crossing New Horizons. So, this past few weeks, I've been obsessed with this game a lot. I've been playing it every single day, and my parents might be annoyed at me. I don't know, who knows? Anyways, today I will not be sadly having a island tour today because my island is still unfinished you know and i want this island to be perfect and you know something that i want it to be because my flowers and trees are still growing in a process so today's video will be all about dream islands new horizons added this feature in the recent update in which you can visit islands without the player itself being online so i can now be able to visit your islands if as long as you send me your dream addresses keep sending me them by the way i would love to see some inspiration see some amazing islands and you know to just get our creativity skills going so if you want to see more gameplay please tell me subscribe to the channel you know like and support the content let's not get into the chit chat further and we will now begin our stream not exactly stream let's begin the video We're now here at our game. There is Dom looking really cute and spiffer with his soft surf head hat thing. I love him. His baby. So first we will check our DMs on my or mentions on my Animal Crossing in uh, on I will now check my mentions on my Animal Crossing Twitter. I will link it, by the way, is still in the description below if you still haven't followed it. It's Tsukishima Isle, I, where I put my updates on my island and everything in, else in between, basically. The happenings in my island, basically the tea or something. So now this is my character. As you can see, look, she's looking spiffy. She's looking pretty. And now, since we're visiting, tra we're traveling to Dream Island today, we'll go back to our house. Alright. Okay. KK metal in the background. Let's go up. So the first island that we're going today, I'm really really excited for it. Sure get some, yeah, get some sleep. Let's meet Luna again in our dreams. So the first island that we're going to visit first is named Kairos and it's given to me by the, this username and we're really excited that's the island let's now get into the dream island the first ever dream island on this huge first youtube gameplay by yours truly so i really apologize if my gameplay video suck at the moment i will improve as time goes you know it's my first gameplay video that is this elaborate of some sort. So yeah, I'm really, really excited to see what inspiration this has. Apparently, according to the original um, original island curator, rep resident representative of Kairos, it's a teamless island. So the team is just elsewhere, basically. There's no team, there's, n there's no team at all. But it's just basically like a place where they unleash their creativity for sorts and yeah let's explore all right so this is kairos basically and let's first check their map to see what villagers and stuff they have so their name is k in the game so there we have diana agent s tommy kit kat Lucky, Coco, Fang, Marshall, Sherb, and Poppy. So basically, a mix basically. That's neat. Some are really, really well known. Some are really famous. I think Marshall is a very well known one. Sherb as well. You know. Some are here are slightly underrated more. So this is Kairos. So basically, it's a star fruit thing. I love how they did the. the uh, flag, you know, it's very detailed, you know, down to the last pixel. That's really cool, you know. So they have some stuff here, mermaid tiaras, okay, what red balloons, hyacinth wand, and a pirate treasure crown. That's neat. So we have some music playing here in the background. So basically, this is like their band area, which is pretty amazing. Look at that. <laughs> this is nice. What song are they playing though? Fudge. Okay, there's no song. <laughs> So we 
have here the Able Sisters area. Neat. The marketplace. This down. This is like so. This is basically their down square area. Yeah. This is like their mini library. That's pretty neat. Like their would take on Starbucks. Ooh, I love this sign. I love this sign. So this sign is basically like their take on Starbucks, but it's Marshall in the face. That's pretty neat. Marshall could be the face of Starbucks, you know? It's pretty nice. So yeah. And now we have here their diner. As you can see their diner here. We'll open a typical diner with their stuff in here. We'll take a seat over here. We'll have some food to munch on every morning or lunch or dinner. Let's go over here then. Next up, their nooks crannies over here. Love that. By the way, to those curious, if you want to go to Nook's Cranny or Able Sisters, unfortunately you can't go there. It's said due to unusual circumstances, we'll be closed today. That unusual circumstance is that this is a dream, you know, so whatever happens in a dream just stays in the dream. Am I recording? Yep, there you're recording. So we have these wheels spinning, so this is like basically their amusement area with the balloons over here. So be springy ride-ons, their playground, their slides, their tricycles. Their toolboxes, kit canes, cotton candy, so their rocket, their spinning wheel. Okay, I got black, that's nice. So this is like next up here we have like their fishing area per se. Not exactly their fishing area, but like relaxing beach area. You no, know, just chilling with the huge shark in there and some fried octopus and cooler than their portable CR in case they want to pee or dress up after a good swim and then we have here their uh, surfboards I love that the creativity and simplicity of this area you know the way to run around we have the ball a place where you can relax in here it's pretty neat two hammocks pretty much an essential I love how they use this pin well as a as a decoration you know so that they have at least something spinning on their island you know so we have their purple hyacinths and pansies I think yeah there's a pansies okay. so now we go over here we'll jump over this stuff boing boing so this is like basically their entrance you know I love how they did their entrance it's quite unique and let's take a seat over here so the first thing you're going to view is like these statues and if you want to go afk you can take a seat here and destination signpost so that you will know where you'll go in your trip so let's go this way we try to go this way so basically it's a hopin island so this is their campsite so this is where oh there's sure let's say hi to him where's my pillow same your concern is your pillow. So anyways, this is their campsite. Very neat, very uh, beachy, simple, nice. I love how you just take on with it, you know, like a typical very small campsite. I love that. The campsite sign, mosh lamps. I love the waterfalls in here. Very creative. And what I love about this one is like, it's like a Paris city per se. You know, like whenever you go to a Dutch city, a very downtown, like Paris city, I don't know. It's something like this, and I love it. The like the treasure chest over here on the beach, nice touch. Hyacinth lamps on the table, so they that so that everything has light. And then some this like their uh, hallway per se, and then this area is. The arcade game area. We have our break tappers in here. Let's play some games over here. It's pretty nice. Love that, love that. I love this area. It's nice. Really, really nice. You know, I feel like this place would be amazing if this was at lit up at night. You know, I love these lights. Love them so much. And I love the pretty fresh town like inspiration in this area you know i want to expand my vocabulary and explain these words because i personally don't want to just say oh that's cute and stuff because i don't know i want to be i want to make sure that my vocabulary improves every time i make these youtube videos limau so first who's i i think this is agent s's house I think, let me check because i it's blocked in the way okay so this is agent s's house okay 
So this is so I think they're a jock, I think. So they have these stuff. So I have this treadmill. I wanted to have a treadmill on my island. Right now I don't have. So please if you want have a have them, please give them to me. Anyway, so this is our next so this is like oh so this is like the residential area then I see. That's neat. So yeah, I like that. I think this is Marshalls. No, this is not Marshalls. I'm pretty sure this is not Marshalls. Okay. Oh, that's Fangs. Okay, and then beside is Kit Kid Cat, another jock. Ooh, Ooh it's Coco. Cool. Let's say hi to her as well. I don't think we've met before. How long you see new faces? I hope you enjoy yourself during your stay. Maybe when we share the system. Oh, she's smart. I love that. I'm cute. <laughs> oh God. I'm in my island as well. Actually, I have nicknames that are basically funny puns in Filipino. Like for example, sis, like Beshi, or the things that I say all the time with my friends. Mom, sir, with the lily of the valleys. Usually, we all you get this when you have five stars. They just grow out of nowhere. The lighthouse. Ooh, love this. Love this area. I wanted to have this beach side table, you know? I still don't have a catalog for it. I love this area. Like, the residential area is pretty neat and fresh. Like, it still resembles a town, yet it's pretty nature -y, you know? Yeah. I love how what they did with the with these yards. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. So, we have this. What's this? So, this is like the view like like if you want to have a view of all the flowers i love what they did here like a forced perspective you know like you're up on a hill and then there are flowers leaning all over you you know pretty neat over there over there it's really nice to look at see also a really nice place as well to look at the fireworks you know nice and the stone hedge in the middle too that's fine hi fine and this is like the uh, plant house, I mean plant area. Wait, plant area? Plant house, yeah. Plant house! Okay, let's get down here. Let's get, down, let's get down here. Let's go to the other side. So I think this area is still pretty under construction, I think. I think this area is still pretty under construction, but, that, but uh, that's good, you know. You know, progress is still progress. So, just say hi to Tammy. Judai me. So, hi, Judai me. Hey, can you tell me what I'm going to sing and drama go now in here? I think this is like their play area, maybe. Maybe this, this, will, this area will grow soon. It's not yet done, but you know, I love the spaciousness of this island. You know, sorry, I'm going back to that area. Oh, let's see. Let's see that area, actually. It's, Looks pretty neat. I haven't went up there. Oh, that's really nice. So this like a very fancy like area. Love the custom designs they put in here. You know, Nintendo, if you're seeing this, please give us more custom slots. You could imagine the power we have with this custom slot. Imagine the power we, if we have more custom slots. Sorry about that. There it was suddenly a bang on the door. So this is like their. So I loved what they did here. It's like a perspective in which we have a castle over here. Love that. Love that. Love that. Love that. Love this. I love this. I love how they did with a perspective. I love what the the players did with forced perspectives. To be honest, I can't do that. It's hard. You know. Salute to those players who still do it. You know, and use their camera skills to do stuff. And then this is like their tiki area, maybe their uh, outside beach cafe. Love I love, I love this. I love this area. I love this so much. And behind, this is just a lot of cute things where they chill, like a tiki cafe. They eat and then swim, you know, those typical stuff. I love the layout of this island, actually. It's pretty nice. Simple but amazing. So let me just whoopsie. <laughs> okay. So we have to see the over here. What else can we get over here? Let's 
let's go on this bridge. So if we go over here, I think this will be like their orchard. So I think this is like the relaxing area per se. It was like their jacket per se. Ah, oh, whoops. It's like their movie area. Oh, I just noticed. I just noticed. So this is like their movie area. So they can take a seat, admire the flowers, and watch a movie at the same time. I was planning to do this actually, but to do the black thing here. The only problem is on my island, I already have used so much custom slots. And I hate it. Nintendo, please. If you're watching this, please add. And so we have our like Japanese Zen Garden. Really neat. I love this area. It's really tranquil per se. So then we just are now approaching this rainbow uh, hyacinth uh, field. Hyacinth flower field. I think they're, they're going to add more flowers in here as they grow more. They're going to grow more here. Let's go here. The stone face, iconic. And then this area would be like their secret beach. So this like red is gonna come here and then he's going to unwind. Oh, I love this one. He's gonna unwind, spend the day by the fan, get some food when he arrives at the island. So that that's the first thing that he's gonna see. See, see, see. And then that way is the museum. Okay. But actually, so this is their house. This is not their house. Okay. This is not their house. It's this actual. Oh, that's Lockie's house. All right. So that's Lockie's house. Okay. The mommy dog. Mommy dog. Mommy dog. Okay. How do you get to the museum? Wait. So we have another hallway out here. We go upstairs. And oh, we have the friend Kay here. Let's see what she says. Sausu, welcome to Kairos. I oh, love it, love it. I love the theme of their house. It's very red, the retro, red vintage, you know, red vintage. Should I even, wait, I'll try to visit her house. Just to see a look on what their aesthetic in their house looks like, you know, what they're tasting here. Because I need some inspiration for my house. Because mine is just scattered team and ugly. Honestly, this is beautiful. I love this area, you know. In the flooring, I need better flooring. It needs better flooring. I need better flooring. Sarah, please give me better flooring. I am so unlucky with flooring. But there's some though that are great. Whoa, you have a lot of rob robot heroes. I mean, salute to you. I mean, I robot heroes are like hard to craft. Okay, let's go in this room. So I, so the first room was like a very Greeky inspiration. There's like their mini library per se, mini library where they put the trophies, they have a seat over here, have a seat over here, okay? Love that, love that, very vintage very, very nice actually, very, very nice. Love this area, love that area, love that area so much. Let's go over here, wonder what they have. Mm. Their kitchen, okay. I love their kitchen. Okay, 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 okay. Very red and very, very red and very brown. Love the accents on this one. Love it, love it. I love, I love. To be honest, I need more space on mine too because it sucks and I hate it. Like, my kitchen, my room is low-key, like my island, I can't say that I'm low-key proud of. I don't know it's not getting done, but my house, it speaks a little different for me. Let's go upstairs. Alright, we have here our, ooh, they have Raymond. Raymond, ooh, that's nice. I love those lights. I need those lights. Give me them lights. You know, I want to have these lights soon, maybe soon, you know. And then we have bow, we have some paintings over here, twinkling painting. 
I love the Walmart TV with the switch over here. And you just take a seat over here, watch TV, play the switch like what I'm doing right now. Lamau. Really nice, really nice, really, really nice. And they have a uh, dinner table here where you can eat with your friends. I think it's like the thing where you get it for your birthday and then, you know, ch chill out, you know. Ooh, Celeste. No, I needed better luck in finding more really, really gorgeous, gorgeous wallpaper and flooring. I know I have some, you know, the butterfly wall. I love that one. I used that in my kitchen. So this is like a mermaid room, I see. Like they're mermaid underground room. KK bubblegum. Bubblegum KK. Whoops. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. I love the... Okay, love the tones of those areas. The basement. To be honest, what I use in my basement, I don't have materials much on there because I use that for my turnip, turnip storage because I don't want to mess my island up with this PC to four stars again. Damn you, Isabel. I'm trying to make stonks. So we have more houses over here. Houses over here. Houses. I love what they did here. Quite very neat special as well so that they have spaces to do stuff because my residential area is quite what you would say just a little tad simple let's go down over here wait how do you access oh okay okay i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm clumsy so we have our space over here, we can take a seat while you wait maybe for people to finish stuff, maybe, waiting area. So this is the amber key. So this area, what I would presume is the museum. I love what they did here. We have fancy fancy entrances mine is just oh my god i i just whipped the my museum in the last whip so my I, my my museum isn't as fancy or elegant of an entrance as theirs i mean look love what they did with the floor lights and the doors and the i mean the doors the fossils and the statues i love this i love this i love this i love this like they have these waterfall things really amazing maybe i could use this as inspiration once maybe i'll restart my island hopefully but i'm still too lazy i don't know if that's it for the trip over here but yeah I really really enjoy this island at first uh, I really really enjoy this island I love it so much actually so thank you for sharing me your dream address to let me explore your island and see what is there to behold so the next island we're gonna visit today is sent to me by Devon, Devon, I don't know how to pronounce your name, I'm really sorry. But it's sent to me by use by the name of Devon and their username is Cap underscore Oak. So their name of the island is apparently called Cap Oak. So now we'll be going there. Very exciting. So I'm also gonna take some pictures after this video. For the first time they'll let it slow. KK Metal. KK Metal immediately on the background. We love that. They have taste. I don't know about y'all, but KK's Metal is my favorite KK Slider song. Change my mind. If I'm right, I'm right. But overall, I'm right. Okay. Next up, we have Combo, baby. So, I love the simplicity of their flag. Yes, I will rate your flags as well. I'm not a very creative person, but I will rate your flags as it is. So, let's check their flag. I mean, map. <laughs> So their map, so we have Devon, we have Eric, Philbert, Biff, Al, Dizzy, Dizzy, Ketchup, Roald, Rosie, Ring around, Rosie, Phoebe, and I think that's Hornsby. Okay, so I really love their selection of villagers here. It's pretty neat, pretty fantastic. Even though that I, um, many people really hate Al because he's ugly. I don't know why. I mean, 
I think I think his outdoor house is pretty nice, you know. Just putting it out there. Love the diversity. Love the diversity though. Nice. And so we have the stuff, golden rod, outdoor scenic, with if you want to, you know, travel. So let's say hi to Rosie. She has been one of my dreams kinda too, but yeah. I just needed a caught villager. I might have a villager hot video out soon. Once <laughs> tell me the truth. I like real oof. <laughs> so I will have a villager hunt video out soon once one of my villagers will be out and no one will out will support it. So I will, will be looking for a smog, a cat, or basically anything that I don't have right now because my islanders are not very flexible at the moment. I have one sister and stuff. So we have this area. Sorry for backing off track. <laughs> so we have we will make our way down here. So we have this simple nice area where you can see the museum out here. I love the simplicity of the entrance here where you could just take a seat while you wait for the others. Nets and net nets are net for uh, catching your bugs or something. Love this area. Love it. Love this area as well. Down here, we have our sports area. So if you want to play soccer, if you want to play basketball, you can totally do that. Let's make our way down here more. And we have our, our rock climbing walls and our back boxing air so i think basically this is like their outdoor gym i love what they did with this outdoor gym you know everything is on here perfect for the jocks perfect for the jocks okay so i think i have to punch in the wrong area nice 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 i love what they did here it's very spacious perfect for a gym as it should be and we have our beach area here where they could sit down, take a glass of water, freshen up, play piano by the beach. Very romantic. We'll make our way over here to our relaxing area. We'll make our way here next to like like the um, place where you could watch someone play harp. Harp place. Harps I heard are really expensive in Animal Crossing. So if you have a harp, you must be rich, probably. So let's make our way. Let's make our way. Let's go here and see what their entrance is. I am very curious on their entrance. Oh. Okay. Pretty neat. I love their entrance. So this is Dodo Adventures. Okay. Dodo Airlines. And we have uh, tips here. If you want to put some tips for taking the person on making visiting your island, it's like a typical entrance of a town. Love that. And we have two nice bridges to connect. I love what they did here. It's like a flowing river. We have able sisters here, more waiting areas, and a nook's cranny. Enter here, we have more beach areas where you can relax, have a nice little picnic. Love the pinwheel. Love, love the pinwheel. And we have ketchup. Let's say hi. Hey, you're a stranger, you're new around here, right? Or like, maybe I'm new around here? I mean, who knows, right? Anyway, I think you're going to like Hapo. It's so dreamy, B. It's definitely very dreamy. And we have our hammocks, our surfboards, our tricycles, barbecue grill, inflatable sofas, beach chairs, music, a garden gnome, a lot of things. I love what they did here. It's nice. Very beach-like indeed. Very, very beach-like. 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 Let's get out over here and see more. So this is more of their foresty areas, chess, and then more um, like puppet show thingy, swing bench, love this, love, love, love. Oh, that's Eric. I love to know each other, but I can be like line land It's pretty great, you know, for a small mass plant floating in water. 
and then we have a little cafe a beach cafe i love the, uh, the colorings on this pretty white i hear you no know? well it's time to let's start welcome to the island oh, thank you Love the love it, love it. And then we go down here and we have a puddle. Presumably when someone spilled water over it. Horseshoe crabs. A more chill area here. They could play some ping pong. Okay, love that. More water spillage from the fish. I love that attention to detail, you know, because spillage in water is pretty normal. Are there more stuff over here? Okay, there is a bike. <laughs> Let's make our way up here. I love what they did with the waterfalls. It's pretty nice. Let's make our way here. So this area presumably would be the or the orchard or orchard. I love how they labeled it. So it's just the fruit itself with the boxes of the said fruit to label them. And then this it's like their farm. We have some saplings over here. We have some watermelon where they could plant some stuff. Water pump. Their little, their little plant area. So this is like their farm per se. I love how they connected an area relating to each other. It's nice of that. Raw honey. Okay, so this is like where they get their honey. So we have some honey spillage. That's nice. And then some honeycombs be some be hunters be hunter stuff more fishing areas mm -hmm. this one unique fishing area and we have our flowers presumably this is like where they put their hybrids on so that they can build more weeds or flower crowns we go up here and we make our way to our dear campsite. Campbell has should have a campsite. Love. Love the simplicity of this. They could just take a seat and make some food. I love how they made the forest. This very, very foresty. I love how they made foresty. So I presumably think this is their residential area now. Their rock garden. I want to make a rock garden, but like, I'm too lazy to organize. Let's see. Ooh, we have the Z. <laughs> you don't look like a sandwich. <laughs> Do I look like a sandwich? So there's like the rainbow, rainbow flower garden area. Very, very organized. We go down here. Am I going down here? Okay. Okay. And I think this is the play area. Play area with cookie flop fortune cookies purpose presumably i think they're a marketplace where they could diy stuff maybe or you know play some games outside we go here this is like the pond where they could fish so maybe the villagers want to have their fish as well so they fish over here fishing land their own fishing land we go up here, love the balloons. Am I doing this right? So this area is very is very towny because we call it I don't know if I'm spelling it right. So this is the guy who owns the island, Devon. How's your day been? Day's been doing great. That's nice. And your island's been fantastic. So we make our way over here to his house. Love the fossil stone fossil stone uh, door plate fossil door plate oh my gosh i love it i, I love the vintage of this take a shot every time i say vintage -y. not exactly vintage -y, but you know very modern like you know neat let's go here let's go here to this area And this is like their maybe studio area where they could take a seat, maybe even do their work, watch some TV. I love the monochrome style 
concept they have here but they still made it not plain you know with a bit of pop of color nice we go to the right let's see what they have on the right I feel like most of the kitchens are like right here you know in the right area in the left area it's just either bathroom or something that they they wish to have we have our espresso maker over here love the use of simple paneling here simple panels are like the god of the of decorating you know like if you have a simple panel you might as well do something good with it I love the mix of colors, the blacks, the reds, and the whites, and some greens as well. We go up, not upstairs. We go here in the middle room. Let's see what we have here in the middle room. Ooh, this is really, really nice. So this like their house of achievements, you would say. House of achievements. I mean, room of achievements. They keep their prized possessions in here. Love the color combination. The golds, the browns. Even the app is added there. Nice. We go up here. Presumably, it would be their bedroom or something may have oh yes oh my gosh that's lovely i love this bedroom so we have our fireplace here where you could take a seat over here and also the back is the clothesline so they could be able to dry their clothes in and the vanity area their bed sadly though you cannot dream in a dream so you just sleep in a dream very white actually very white minty Perfect for waking up. I love this guy's color combinations. You know, it's somehow this it's somehow very different in each room, you know. It just gives that vibe off of him. And this area is the basement gaming room. Love the rocket lamps. Yeah. And we have our switch over here. Oop. And we have a TV. TV to watch TV. Oh yeah, place to watch TV. We have a uh, ACNH edition switch, the uh, football, basically their arcade room in the basement. I love how they have so much collection in there. It really gives that vibe. Really, really gives that vibe. Okay, now we'll go out. Now we're done with the house. I think I haven't. Wait. Let me just check just to make sure. Okay, I already traveled this area. Sorry. Let's go up because we haven't traveled the up way yet. The up way yet. So this is the residential area, as I said, in like a few minutes ago. We have downstairs. We have another bridge. Which does this guy have? <laughs> Not judging, it's really nice. Love the bridge. I think this it will be the upstairs, okay. This area is like the chill maybe area, you know, where you could sit by the moon. There's celestial area, the chill, relaxing area. More t your turnips for stocks. That's really a nice addition as well because you needed money, you needed your money. So we have our turbine to keep the energy flowing. Whoops. And then over here, we have our viewing area where you can view the moon, celestial area, the stars. You just take a seat here and craft. I love what they did here, you know, the based on the terraforming they did. Well, be really nice, you know, simple but amazing. We have reached another floor of the residential area love what they did here though it's very symmetrical in here love the symmetry so we have 
Yes, yes, yes. This is a month. I'm not sure if these are dollar bills or not, or something, but I think this is where they take a seat. More seating areas. It's just all laid out so beautiful, you know? And we go down here to be welcomed by Red. So, yeah. There's like a secret beach. You can be welcomed here and then go up. More bonfires where they could take a seat over here. They, I'm pretty sure this place will be warm. Like warm. I love the, the I love this island so much because of how they take nature, you know. It's very foresty and yet not too foresty, you know what I mean? It's very natural per se. It really gives us a taste of a camp resort that is very leaning to very not too natural inspiration you know it sounded so deep in there but okay not really so i think we're done i think with our tour i think have i visited yup i think i visited everything everything yup i visited everything and now we'll be on our way to our last stop in our dream island excavation and i am really excited to see the last one because i'm pretty sure this island will be great as well so i'll talk to you guys later once we get to that island yeah so yeah thank you so much devon for letting me share your island your dream address onto my twitter account it's pretty nice i love your island so much I could take some inspiration there. Once I get to restart maybe or maybe to adjust some stuff. But you know in the end, um, everyone has their own creativity, you know, just because you take your just because you think while reading your island, like just because you think it's ugly doesn't mean it's ugly to others, you know, everyone has different tastes. You know? The reason that your island just seems so small compared to theirs is because you already know what's on your island while in their point of view, they don't know what's up on your island yet. So now we will have next our island which is Paridolia. Paridolia by AC and H Miria. The username is right here and basically their island is like a giant maze and you know it is meant to be an entertainment so this could be a ride you know i am happy that i made this the last island that i'll visit for today because it said that it is meant to give you entertainment and it's a very very like a maze okay we're now here oh so they're from the southern hemisphere i see so it's winter. Now in deep slumber. Okay. Okay. So now we have Pari. What's the name again? Okay. Paridolia. Paridolia. Okay. Paridolia. Paridolia. <laughs> okay. So as you can see, we have four friends over here. We have Miria. We have Box. We have Lolo and Yaya. So I think they share an island over here. Nice. We have Pashmina, Coco, Fang, Peko. Julia and Bill, Eric, Tangy, Molly, and Julia. So pretty nice selection of villagers out here. Pretty, pretty nice, pretty nice. I think it's very, di pretty diverse for you know species. So we'll rate your flag. I love this one. It's very cute, and there's heart over there too. I love how they did the heart. It's very accurate. I love it. So we are surrounded, as you can see, by these waterfalls and mountains. And we dug deep over here. So this is the entrance, basically. So we have some rocks over here. We are surrounded by mountains and flowers. So I think this will be like a mountainous area. So we'll start over here. Oh, so this makes me amazed. Okay. Okay. Sorry, I saw. Forgive me. Oh, so this is what Let me just go back. <laughs> I'm such a dumb dumb. Okay, let's see where to go next. Oh, it's here. Okay. It's 
So we dug ourselves to some ice cream. And then right here, okay. Where well, you could see the uh the creature between these bamboos. Okay, nice, nice. With the gongs. Like this is like they're very uh very very oriental oriental area per se we take a seat here that's peko hi peko it's actually see you again though maybe we haven't met before have we oh but sorry about that i just woke up for a moment because jason getting my bearings okay See what else are we going to go to? Okay, okay, we're gonna go up here. Okay, and then we have. I forgot what this is called! Oh my god! I forgot what this is called in Japan. But it's something that there's this like warmth underneath the third table. And we're gonna go up in here, and this is maybe their plant house, their farm, okay, their farm, their orchards, their orchards. Oh, so that's a chair, okay, okay, I thought it's not a chair. Okay, I'm, I'm stupid, I'm very surely, I may be stupid, <laughs> but I am stupid. Okay, so we're just gonna take a seat over here, so yeah really amazed but you know a very nice clean unique maze like not like other maze like there like you would just you know put some mountains over there and you could call it a maze and make it a day but this is actually pretty nice and entertaining actually it still suits the team that you're looking for nice so i'm pretty sure this is a residential area more residential areas over here saplings some plants can you go over here with more stuff more trees okay another residential area okay you take a seat over here so whose house is this bill's house okay so he has this gym equipment. And then we go over here. More gym stuff. Oh, it's laggy. Oh, okay, okay. More stuff. Their basketball area. A snowflake. Then we go down here to maybe like a waiting area for a train, like a train stop. Here we have some trains over here. Chugga chugga choo choo. And now we head ourselves to our maybe this will be the museum area. Museum area. Museum area. Museum area. With a lot of fossils. Am I even doing this right? I don't think I am. Wait, let me just. Okay, let's go up here. Okay. We're doing great. So we'll head over here to jump. There you go. Okay. And then we'll go over here. And then over here. And then we'll jump over here. you can't go there okay so I guess we have to jump over there somehow wait how did we struggling for me so five minutes how do you what the heck wait 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 wait
This video might take long because of this me, Silimo. <laughs> but you know, I am not a quitter. And there's no way that I'm a quitter. So I have to do my best. Okay. I love how unique this maze is, you know, it's not just a maze because it is a maze, as I said, like twice. So we're just gonna go downstairs, right, right, oh, we're gonna go here. Oh wait, we're not doing this right now, I'm just gonna slide down here, no, I don't know, slide down here. I think we need this right, I think, but I'm just... Not finding the right spot because there is a specific spot where you can proceed. So this is the spot. A cycle of oh, my brain is just fried. <laughs> but you know, I'm not really angry. You know, I'm really, really enjoying this island. It's just. Oh god, I'm very frustrated. Where's the last thing? Right here. Okay. So, let's see. Oh, so this is the. Wait, oh my gosh, I'm so dumb! You are you supposed to go there, oh my gosh! Okay, okay, it's possible. I'm just dumb. Okay. <laughs> my brain cells are dying. Say hello, hello, welcome. Okay, thank you very much. So this is like your area, spa area. I'm just gonna take a seat here. Check your map again. Okay. So this is their campsite. Okay, neat campsite. I love the campsites. Nice, nice, nice. Can you access it through here? No, you cannot access it through here. So it's really covered. So we have the post office. I'm relaxing this song. So anyways, this is the post office now. And we're done visiting the cafe, which is nice. I love how they used it into like taking your order and then the bathroom. So in this area, this is where you take care of shipping. Love that. Love that additional detail. To use cardboard boxes laying around. That's pretty resourceful. More shipping. Alright. Let's go out of here. I love how they like tackle and ask their friends to you know make these houses into like different buildings since animal crossing new horizon doesn't have much buildings like such as cafes post offices speaking of cafes when will they bring brewsters back i really want brewsters back you know so that we could make coffee and we could have our own cafes we could customize our own cafes to our will welcome all right next up we have the fountain we have fountains disabled sisters and then we head straight to wherever are we going to? We're going straight here. Yay! We finish! You finish! Yay! <laughs> I'm so happy. We're finally done after I don't know how many minutes that was in this maze. It's really amazing. We didn't have to take a picture actually. Okay, let's take a picture. Because, oh my gosh, I cannot believe we actually finished this maze. I love this maze. It's really challenging. I love this so much. So, yay, you finished. And, yeah. Basically, we have our seat at the throne now that we're finally done. Souvenirs, everyone. See it at the throne that we're done. Yay! I'm finally done. So unfortunately, in this we cannot visit. We cannot visit the real owner, Miria. We cannot visit, sadly, and also Bax. We cannot, I think, visit them because I think it's all blocked. 
from this maze. So yeah, at least I'm really happy that I actually finished this maze. I appreciate the effort that the you know that the that the creators of this island has in store. So thank you so much, Miria, ACN underscore Miria, for this really really amazing maze. So now our time here in Miria in Paridonia. Paridonia. Paridolia, sorry, sorry for watching it. So, our time in Paridolia is finally done, and now we're going back to sleep. Look at me! I love how I look. I look fresh. <laughs> Shout out. So guys, that is it for my gameplay. I really, really enjoyed all of the islands that I visited. If you want me to visit your island, please send me more dream addresses on my Twitter Instagram, Twitter account on Animal Crossing New Horizons, which is Krishma Isle. I'll link it in the description below always. And also, don't forget the links of how you can help with the world in the description below as well to donate and everything also um if you want to visit my island my dream island is open at the moment although i will update it in the future once the time is right and everything is finished so i'm really really excited to show you guys as well here is the dream address if you want to visit my island to see it for yourself for the meantime but it's still not yet done though just a heads up it's not yet done the most updated one is not yet done. It, it is continuously updating and updating. So yeah, that marks the end of my video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm really excited to play more Animal Crossing with you guys. And maybe more Switch games if I have more Switch games. Make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Comment down below. Subscribe to my channel as well. We're almost to maybe around 400, 500 subscribers right now. And I'm really happy of us to be a family again. And I will see you guys in the next video. And kisses for all. Bye-bye.